hey, so my last couple videos for you, which I'll link to underneath this video, have been about finding your purpose in life. Something that I've been on a journey of self-discovery for, particularly of late. And there are two books that I've read that have really changed my perspective on where we derive our true purpose and meaning and fulfillment and joy in life. One is The Second Mountain. The other is called Falling Upward. And today I want to share with you one of the most deep and meaningful quotes that I found in the book Falling Upward by Richard Rohr. It really made me realize that when you when you find that purpose and that fulfillment in life, sometimes it can be painful and sometimes it can take effort. And I think this will really help you to come to that same realization that I came to. It goes like this. Just remember this. No one can keep you from the second half of your own life except yourself. Nothing can inhibit your second journey except your own lack of courage, patience, and imagination. Your second journey is all yours to walk or to avoid. My conviction is that some falling apart of the first journey is necessary for this to happen. So do not waste a moment of your time lamenting poor parenting, a lost job, a failed relationship, a physical handicap, gender identity, economic poverty, or even the tragedy of any kind of abuse. Pain is part of the deal. If you don't walk into the second half of your own life, it is you who do not want it. God will always give you exactly what you truly want and desire. So make sure you desire, desire deeply, desire yourself, desire God, desire everything good and true and beautiful. Makes you think quite a bit about taking charge, making things happen, making no excuses, leaving your pity party behind and embarking upon that second journey with a commitment to not only the pain and suffering that will be a part of that journey, but also the deep joy and fulfillment you'll experience as a consequence of that adventure. So for more, I highly recommend you read this book, Falling Upwards. It was very, very insightful and meaningful for me, and I hope it will be for you too.